Hi there, this is Paul and I'm going to show you how to create a sprite and moving, uh, moving it around the screen by using the directional keys. Well, the first thing we need is a sprite. So we go to sprites, right click, create sprite and we load the sprite here. I have a beautiful red box. Now I'm going to name it I'm not going to use precise collision checking so I just deselect it and we are done. Now I need an object. Go to objects, right click create object, name it and now we are going to assign the sprite we already created to this object and we are done. Well, as you may know, KingMaker is an event-driven engine, so all the code must be placed in these events. We are going to add the create event and we are going to use it for variables initializations. Speed. The, the speed of our sprite. And we are done. Now, I want to move the sprite around the screen by using the directional keys. These keys are left, right, up and down. And we have an even for each of these keys. Just go to keyboard and select one of the four directions left. And now we are going to add the code for the left event. So every time the player presses the left key, this is the, the piece of code that is going to be executed. This is pretty basic stuff, exclusive for beginners. So if you are intermediate or advanced, please skip this video. With this single line of code, we're moving our sprite to the left. And now we're going to do the same, but this time for the right direction. Add the element for the right key we are the code, we paste the line we use for the left key event, but now we change the sign and we add a plus. As you know, this line of code moves the sprite to the right. Well, now I am going to do the same for the up and down keys. Up. Well, now we are going to move our sprite vertically, so we change this variable and we are down and last our event for the down key. We change the sign, we add the plus. And we are done. Well, we created our sprite, we created our object. Now we need a room in order to put this object and run the game. Go to room, rooms, right click, create room. Here I have an empty room. I select my only object and just place it inside the room and we are done. 
Now, I want to run the, the game in full screen. And uh, here we go. Well, here I can move sprite left, right, up, and down. And um, because we use an event driving approach, if I press up and right at the same time, both events are executed. Down and left, up and left, down and right. And that's it. Pretty, pretty basic stuff. This is the first video tutorial, so I'm going to show more advanced stuff in the upcoming videos. Hope you like it. Feel free to post any comment, questions, wherever. Okay, that's it. See you in the next video tutorial.